Sa Jimura Flet is considering you join from Master United Takeover as his takeover bid is dead according to multiple reports. So let's get down to it, guys. So welcome to Football Gossip about Master United. If you are new to this channel, please do it, subscribe, like the video, leave a comment below, and watch this video today. So let's get into it, guys. So Rain Group continues to engage with multiple sectors, but there is a growing sense that Chris must alter his structure if he is to get board approval. Nitro Foundation bid is clear transaction according to Ben Jacob. So let's get down to it more. So, Nice Foundation is more positive following the improved fifth offer, but there's also still skepticism over the Glazers' intention and those close to the uh, group view the most likely outcomes as the Qatar wins on no sir. Understand that are going to Ben Jacobs. So now Sajima Flex is now losing every day. He's now getting closer to let's go of the United Takeover. As according to multiple reports from Plumberg journalist David Bradcliffe Bid is actually now going dead and see Gazi Biamedatani is reportedly set to be the next owner of Manchester United after his powerful world record 6 billion bid for the position to buy Manchester United as he's now very confident he's gonna go to his way as now Ellen David actually reports the same as he's a great journalist as he says there is a problematic rascally bid being dead because the dog wants to wants to buy majority minority stakes and now Ratcliffe only wants to possess the Glazer shares to become a controlling shareholder. Ratcliffe don't want to own the club, he just wants to be a shareholder, he wants to control Master United, he don't want to own Master United, he just wants to get 69% of Master United, whereby he still keeps all six Glazers being stakeholders at the club as now she gas in behind the tiny and this category group are now front runners in the takeover race and Ratcliff is not set to withdraw from the takeover race according to multiple reports so the minority shareholders are said to be considered about their shares dropping in value because of the takeover the shorting legal action and the united directors will not approve Ratcliff bid until the situation is resolved so if any way Ratcliff can win this takeover battle if he is he changed his bid for him to take over master in the 200% so so should the sergeant mafia feel that he would have to directly compete with Shegazi 100% bid they will likely pull out of a D Saji wants to control Shegazi wants to owe according to Jacobs Ben Ben Jacobs Saji Maflet wants to control Master United Why Katari Group then wants to own Master United after the world record 6 billion bid gave them more confidence as they all the Katari reports are just reporting the same and are sending their congratulations to their Katari member who is the Islamic chairman of the Islamic Bank and made a world record bid from his Night Foundation as now Saji Maflet is in the dark and now Qatar is emerging as the front runner and the preferred bidder to take over Master United. The Glazers are considering not losing their share at the club and they may still have an option for them to stay longer and make more money out of the club. They may still have be another round of bid according to multiple reports. The Glazers want more money as they value Master United for a 6 billion bid in the market. The 8 month takeover saga still continues as the Glazers are delaying the say the decision. We are all tired of the Glazers were sick and tired of the Glazers. As now, Sajima Flex will likely have to win the Lega battle, which may be at this moment insurmountable with shareholders unless his bid is changed. So, if his bid is not changed, he won't be the next owner of Master United. He won't control the club. He wants to help Master United, according to multiple reports. Sajima Flex won't want to buy Master United for over the years right now, with the Glazers family having being the shareholders of the club, the majority shareholders of the club for the past 18 years and all the United fans are just protesting against the Glazers. They are shutting down the mega store, they are protesting against the Glazers, they don't want to feed the greedy Glazers anymore and now Sajima Flet is emerging as the front runner of the takeover race. All is the United fans favorite to take over Manchester United. So do, do, who do you want to be the next now of Manchester United? Is this Sajima Flet or Katai Bilunia Sheikh Gaza? As him as now in order for Saji Maflet IOS to be successful, they will have to engage with and participate on all the shareholders, which is 
he wish he be unse- unsuccessful he may have to go down the hundred percent ownership want which he himself is keen on he's not keen on he don't want to own master in that hundred percent that's only the way if he wants to be the next owner of master in that if he wants to be the top and the majority shareholder he wants to have more share more than the glazers and the glazers are still considering not being in Manchester United anymore, they also make more money out of the club, actually dropping a market value of six billion bit. So Sajin Mafet as the next owner is now getting more low and low. His chances of being the next owner and his order of being the next owner of Manchester United is now too low. He might even withdraw out of the takeover, according to Plug Meg journalist David Allen. So he might even leave the takeover bid as now the Glazers are continuing even staying at Manchester United. According to multiple reports, the Glaciers might stay. So is it Shegazim or Sajim Mafia? The Glaciers might even continue staying at Master United. They are still even continuing to move on on another bid, another round of bid. So is it Shegazim or British billionaire Sajim Mafia on the way? Sajim Mafia takeover bid is dead, according to Plunk Bam journalists. According to Plunk Bam athlete, Sajim Mafia takeover bid is dead. Shegazim will emerge as front runner. The Glaciers are now continuing. Just an 100% takeover process that only comes in 100% takeover process. So, check Gazin Biamed Tani is the right man for the Glazers option. So, all the Qatari reports are reporting the same. I will send their congratulations to Sheikh Gazin to be the national of Master United. So, bye for the edibles. Bye, guys. Please do the subscribe to Football Gossip. Now, to see more updates about Master United. Sajin Mafet is in the dark as the Glazers just want 100% takeover. All the might to stay as much time in the all the fans don't want to hear that silly news they don't want the glazers to stay anymore sajim wafer bid is dead according to reports his bid is dead and shegazim is emerging as the front runner and even sajim wafer is still continuing to withdraw from the takeover as shegazim shall be him in the takeover process so bye for the end of it bye guys